Hi, hello, this is Anup here, and in this video, we are going to talk about Microsoft Ignite 2023 Intune session details. Which are the sessions you can watch if you are an online attendee? We are going to discuss about Intune sessions available in Ignite 2023, which is going to happen in November 15th to 16th or 14th to 17th if you are attending it in person. So we will discuss about different types of sessions available and which are the sessions available as a recording and which are the sessions available only for in-person attendees etc. So don't skip the video. Let's go ahead and check this out. Now let's talk about Microsoft Ignite. If you are trying to plan for in-person event, it is already sold out unless and until you have a special pass somewhere, then probably you can still get into. But normally it is sold out so ignite is again hybrid event some parts of it is online and other part of it is in person we'll have more detailed discussion about different types of content available in microsoft ignite and what is available for in person and what is available for online version it is happening in seattle and what is the difference between free version of Microsoft Ignite that is digital version of Microsoft Ignite and in-person version. In-person is paid one and it is already sold out. Let's look at the key differences. Interactive Labs is one of the in-person and even in-person demo that is also only available for in-person attendees. Those are not available for digital or online version of Ignite. Networking opportunities that is also in person access to microsoft experts and partners that is also in person for online attendees there are a lot of options available and which is free now let's check intune sessions over here as part of microsoft ignite 2023 you can see 12 sessions please note about this one will not be recorded this is a demo session and this is only available in person so if you are a online attendee of Microsoft Ignite, this is not going to be available for you. This is going to be a demo session and it is in-person session. It is not available online. It is all about enterprise app management that is third party patching, app protection, etc, etc. And if, if you want to know more about uh, the features of enterprise app management, you might need to wait for blog post from Microsoft in this particular scenario. And there's another session that is all about Windows 11, Windows 365 and Microsoft Intune. It is a discussion and it is a Q&A session and it is available online as well as in person and it will be recorded. And the other session is all about automation and in tune optimizing admin experience. That is a product roundtable session and it won't be available online. So this is only for in person and there won't be any recording also available for this. And in this session, Microsoft is going to talk about Graph API, PowerShell, Power Automate, Azure Logic Apps, etc, etc. Next session is all about Microsoft Intune and this is going to be a breakout session and breakout sessions are normally 300 400 level session it is going to be deep dive session on Intune plus cloud PKI how we are going to deliver cloud PKI service and how we are going to deliver skip certificates using this cloud PKI, how we can connect on-prem PKI with cloud PKI, etc, etc. And this is available online as well as in person and will be recorded. And there is a similar session on security copilot and Intune. And this is going to be a demo session and it is in person only session and it won't be recorded. So if you are an online attendee, you won't be able to get the details of the session at this point of time or during the Ignite. Maybe all these informations and demos will be released later, but not at the time of Microsoft Ignite. And this is the hands-on session with Windows 11 and Intune management and that is only in person. Proactive endpoint management starts here. That is another session. It is a pre-recorded session online 
online only there is no in person session so probably if you are an in person attendee you need to check out this session later modern management and endpoint security innovation that is the another session again it's a breakout session but it is probably for executive level people so if you want to get a very high level details of roadmaps of intune endpoint security this is the session for you managing visual studio in your enterprise this is again a demo session and it is how you can manage effectively visual studio deployments updates using windows update for business in tune etc so this is a demo session available only in person and there is no online version available for this the interesting typo over there in tune is mentioned differently scaling ai to every aspect for your business with windows this is going to be a very high level session and it is going to be all about avd microsoft 365 windows 365 intune etc etc and this will be a breakout session and will be available online as well as in person and recording will also be available another session is about windows 365 and avd and this is going to be a discussion session where discussion session where microsoft will be answering questions from online and in person attendees this is not going to be in tune specific session but it is coming in in tune search results because in session categories there is one tag called microsoft in tune probably there are some points related to in tune in the session but it is not a dedicated in tune session in seattle only means it is available only for in person attendees and if you see in seattle plus online that means it is available for in person as well as online attendees as per the search results you can see 12 sessions and as you have already seen some sessions are not dedicated to in tune but they tagged as microsoft in tune because of some reason and there are different options to refine or filter the search results if you are an online attendee and you want to see only the online sessions you can click on delivery type and click on online that will show you only the online sessions and you can see seven online sessions are there out of 12 and you can check seattle and you can filter on seattle for in person sessions and you can filter based on the session type as well as on topic if you want to check modern work related topics you can do that infrastructure related topics you can check that security related topics if you want filter on dates if you want for example tuesday 14th wednesday 15th so that will show you sessions on that particular date now let's look at different types of content delivery sessions there are five different session types breakout session is the first one listed by microsoft over here and that is 300 to 400 level session it is a detailed technical deep dive session and that is available online and in person i would say and the second type of session is discussions and that is also a hybrid session it is available for online and in person attendees it is mainly focused on smaller groups without powerpoint presentations i would say it is more interactive kind of sessions and the third one is lab in person and lab is mainly for upgrading your hands on skills demo sessions is also in person only like labs it is not available online and the demo sessions are like hope in and hope out kind of sessions and expert meetup sessions is a option only for in person attendees they can meet up with microsoft experts in person and discuss about their scenarios give feedback etc etc that is all about 2023 ignite in tune sessions now that we have discussed about all the details of microsoft ignite 2023 in tune sessions hope this was helpful thank you all for watching see you around